Okay, it's Asia Sky from the DX Daily Podcast, and Lil Wayne and Dallas Mavericks owner Mark Cuban have apparently put an end to their beef days after taking shots at each other over social media. Mac Main took to Twitter Wednesday, May 18th, to reveal that the pair ironed things out with a phone call with the Young Money president himself putting it all together. Mac Main tweeted out, Just got off the phone with M. Cuban and Lil Tunchi. It's all love. Now, the beginning of the beef traces back to May 8th during Game 4 of the Western Conference semifinals between the Dallas Mavericks and the Phoenix Suns, where Lil Wayne called Luka Doncic a ho on Twitter. Just a week later, Luka Doncic dropped 35 points in Game 7 of the series to send the Suns and Wayne's longtime friend Chris Paul home. The following day, Mark Cuban posted a courtside photo of Lil Wayne while quoting lyrics from his 2018 song, Uproar, off the Carter Five album. Cuban captioned the photo, It's a show, put you front row. It didn't take long for Lil Wayne to come across the post, and when he did, he reacted by threatening to beat up Mark Cuban and urinate in his mouth. He said, Mark Cuban, don't make me get you smacked, boy. You playing with me? You little, it's up. Now, according to Skip Bayless, Lil Wayne and Mark Cuban's relationship goes back to 2011 when Lil Wayne was living in Miami and had a season ticket for the Miami Heat. But when the Dallas Mavericks beat the Heat in the NBA Finals, Wayne accepted Cuban's invite to celebrate with the Mavs. But following this recent incident, Skip Bayless revealed he spoke to Lil Wayne about appearing on Skip and Shannon Undisputed, but he was too angry at the time to come onto the show. I have been in touch with our man, Lil Wayne, mm -hmm. about everything that has transpired for years and years between him and Mark Cuban. This is dating back to 2011. I asked Wayne last night, do you want to come on the show with us today to respond to what Cuban posted right. yesterday? And he thought about it, and he finally concluded, I can't, because, frankly, it come across, he's just too angry right now. Right. And he said, <laughs> what, what I would say would not be TV friendly, right. as in language for TV. Correct. And I said, okay, then we'll do it. Yeah, even, okay? even for cable TV, it Thank wouldn't be you. suitable. It, it would not be suitable, because if... If you saw what Wayne responded with and then took down yeah. last night, it was not suitable <laughs> for any kind of television to me. So what do you think about this back and forth between Lil Wayne and Mark Cuban? Do you think either one of them were out of pocket for what they said? And do you think it's really all love between them now? Let us know in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell and keep it locked to Hip Hop DX.